Can sex help alleviate pain? What is the role of sexual education in preventing unwanted pregnancies? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Yes, sex can release endorphins and act as a natural pain reliever, alleviating pain in some people. However, it is not a substitute for necessary medical treatment. Sexual education prevents unwanted pregnancies by providing information about contraceptives, prevention methods, and sexual decision-making. It helps individuals to know contraceptive options, understand their use, and be aware of the menstrual cycle, enabling informed decisions and reducing the risk of unplanned pregnancies. In some native communities in Canada, sexual education programs led by elders and traditional leaders have been developed, integrating ancestral knowledge about sexuality with contemporary approaches to public health and well-being. Cervical sensitivity. Some women experience sensitivity in the cervical area during certain sexual positions, which can cause discomfort or unease if penetration is too deep. Child access. Despite efforts to restrict access to pornography for minors, many children and adolescents still have access to online pornographic content, raising concerns about their sexual education and emotional well-being. In some rural communities in India, festivals and cultural events, including talks and educational activities on sexual and reproductive health are held, leveraging social gatherings as learning opportunities. Comprehensive sexual education. Comprehensive sexual education addresses a wide range of topics related to sexuality, including anatomy, reproduction, healthy relationships, consent, contraception, and prevention of sexually transmitted diseases, with the aim of promoting healthy and safe sexuality. Consent and ethics. Consent from all parties involved is crucial in open relationships, all sexual encounters must be consensual and respect previously established boundaries. Couple therapy. In cases of anorgasmia affecting the couple's relationship, couple therapy may be beneficial for improving communication, addressing underlying issues, and finding joint solutions. Creating a sensual environment. Carefully preparing the environment for foreplay with soft lighting, gentle music, and seductive scents can help create a sensual atmosphere that stimulates all the senses. Cultural differences in sexual expression. The way sexual fantasies and fetishes are expressed varies widely among different cultures. What may be considered taboo in one culture may be accepted or even celebrated in another. Customization. Many sex toy manufacturers offer the option to customize products according to customer preferences, including colors, shapes, and specific functions. Diversity in sexual practices. People engage in a wide range of sexual practices, ranging from the most conventional to the most alternative, and these preferences may vary depending on culture, religion, and personal experiences. Diversity of sexual orientations. In addition to heterosexuality, there is a wide range of sexual orientations, including homosexuality, bisexuality, pansexuality, asexuality, and more, reflecting human diversity in terms of attraction and desire. Dual stimulation positions. Some women enjoy positions that stimulate both the clitoris and vagina simultaneously, such as 69 or missionary with manual stimulation. Effects on mental health. There has been debate about the potential negative effects of pornography on mental health, including addiction, erectile dysfunction, and sexual dissatisfaction. Effects on sexual performance. Some studies suggest that excessive pornography consumption may be related to erectile dysfunction and hypoactive sexual desire in some men. Emotional commitment. Although open relationships are often associated with fulfilling sexual desires, Many couples also experience deep emotional commitment and intimate connection within this type of arrangement. Emotional connection positions. 
For many women, sexual positions involving eye contact, hugs, and tender kisses are especially meaningful as they strengthen the emotional connection with their partner. Erectile dysfunction and couples. Therapy. Erectile dysfunction can have a significant impact on a couple's relationship. Couples therapy can help address communication issues and improve sexual intimacy between partners. Erectile dysfunction and diet. A diet rich in fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and healthy fats can help prevent erectile dysfunction by promoting cardiovascular health and improving blood circulation. Erectile dysfunction and orgasm. Although men with erectile dysfunction may have difficulty achieving or maintaining an erection, they can still experience orgasms, as erection and orgasm are separate processes. Erectile dysfunction and shockwave therapy. Shockwave therapy is a non-invasive treatment that may improve erectile function by stimulating the growth of new blood vessels in the penis. Erectile. Dysfunction and smoking. Tobacco smoking can increase the risk of developing erectile dysfunction, as tobacco damages blood vessels and reduces blood flow, making it difficult to achieve an erection. Ethics of open relationships. Many people in open relationships follow a set of ethical principles that include honesty, respect, and mutual consent as fundamental pillars of their lifestyle. Exploration of sexual fantasies. During foreplay, women often feel more comfortable sharing and exploring their deepest sexual fantasies with their partners, which can lead to greater intimacy and emotional connection. Eye contact. Eye contact during foreplay can increase intimacy and emotional connection between partners, creating a sense of complicity and shared excitement. Fetish community. There is an active fetish community online and offline where individuals with similar interests can connect, share experiences, and explore their fantasies safely and consensually. These communities often organize events, parties, and conventions dedicated to fetishes. Focus on mutual pleasure. The Kama Sutra promotes the concept that sexual pleasure should not only be for oneself, but should be mutual and equitable between partners, reflecting the importance of communication and satisfaction for both parties in intimacy. In European countries like France and Spain, sexual education campaigns in media and social networks are conducted to raise awareness among young people about consent, respect, and prevention of sexual violence. Genital herpes is a chronic and recurrent viral infection caused by the herpes simplex virus, HSV. It has no cure, but antiviral medications can help reduce the frequency and severity of outbreaks. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.